Thank you, Ian. Yes, um, so we know that uh, there was a systematic search here this afternoon. Um, in the early hours of the morning, as we've been reporting, uh, a Spanish customs vessel pursued uh, a vessel that they were suspected uh, that they suspected was involved in smuggling uh, and they followed them into Eastern Beach uh, in the waters right behind me and eventually made their way onto the sand uh, to continue that pursuit of the suspected smugglers. The timeline isn't wholly clear but we know that the suspected smugglers threw stones at the Spanish customs officers as you said, uh, one of them has been seriously injured, two of them injured, one of them seriously injured and in hospital. And we know that at some point uh, the Spanish customs officers, we understand, uh, fired some shots because there is video evidence of that. We haven't uh, confirmed the order of those events. There is a, an ongoing police investigation and in fact this afternoon our cameras uh, filmed the uh, police and army, uh, so the Royal Gibraltar Police and the Royal Gibraltar Regiment, working together in teams of two here on this sand. They divided the area up systematically into squares and they used metal detectors to search. GBC understands they were searching for bullets. As we said earlier, we know that uh, there were certainly uh, sounds recorded by nearby residents of shots being fired. Uh, I think a lot of people's instinct was to think that those uh, will probably have been rubber bullets because it wouldn't be the first time that there is a, a serious incident uh, in which rubber bullets have been fired by Spanish uh, law enforcement in British Gibraltar territorial waters but uh, on this occasion uh, the metal detectors uh, point to the possibility of some metal casings uh, perhaps being searched for by the police uh, and the army. Uh, a few more points to report on um, and that is that um, uh, there is no suggestion uh, that any Gibraltarians were involved in this incident here at Eastern Beach. Um, certainly no arrests have been made in Gibraltar and the law enforcement officers themselves, as, as we said, were, were Spanish customs officers. Uh, speaking of which, the, there is a message from the Spanish customs uh, of um, wishing, uh, sending their best wishes to uh, the customs officers who have been injured. Nuestro apoyo y esperando una pronto y total recuperación para los dos compañeros que durante la persecución a una embarcación sospechosa de ser utilizada para el contrabando han sido heridos de gravedad al ser apredados por un grupo de personas en la playa de Levante de Gibraltar, Eastern Beach, Gibraltar's Eastern Beach, and the Spanish Customs uh, sending a message of solidarity to the injured officers and wishing them a full and speedy recovery. Now the other development this evening down here at Eastern Beach is that uh, residents of the nearby Beachview terraces uh, have been uh, spoken to by police. We understand that the RGP is going knocking door to door and asking for any uh, eyewitness testimonies because there will be people at Beachview Terraces and we know that the, we have spoken to people who heard those gunshots and the police are trying to piece together what exactly happened here uh, in the early hours of this morning and, and the picture will become uh, fuller in the coming hours and days and we'll continue to report on it and fill in the blanks.